Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I am going to do a what's in my bag video. The last one of these, the only time I've done this video was a what's in my travel bag video when um, we went to Centre Parks, I think last March, like as in 2014. Um, I'm almost certain it wasn't this year. Um, so I just thought that I would do another video. I am still filming at my mum's house. I thought I'd just do some videos while I've got like everything set up. Um, this is like true to form. I haven't taken anything out at all. Um, it, it's kind of just how I'm using my bag at the moment. Um, if you don't already know, um, this is kind of a family channel, myself, my husband and our four year old son. So I don't use a changing bag or anything like that anymore. But, uh, and my son has been potty trained for like two, nearly two years anyway. Um, but I do sometimes carry some things for him in my handbag, as mums do and dads. Um, so without further ado, let's get on with the video. This is my bag. You can already see it's like bulging out there. Um, this is the Michael Kors Selma Satchel. I'll just hold it up. Um, it's the large size. I um, got this bag in May and I've been using it a lot since. I don't use it all the time because it's kind of the only um, like designer bag that I own. Um, and I did treat myself to it um, and I absolutely love it. I did a lot of research, a lot of um, reading of reviews and everything else and um, it just works out really well for me. Um, it's got the grab handles here. And it's also got the crossbody strap, which I have got on, and I do use when, um, like, I'm out and about with the family because I can just kind of throw it on my shoulder, and then I've got, you know, my hands free. But I do also use it for work, and I do kind of put it on the crook of my arm, so that works really well as, as well. You'll know the bag by now. There are no pockets on the outside, and you do have like these little wing pockets, which are brilliant. Um, it's zipped up at the moment so what i do is i'll unzip it it is chaotic it's just as it as i use it really um nothing's in order i do clear out my bag so i might use this as an opportunity to clear out my bag but <laughs> that's kind of how my bag is currently looking so let's show you what's actually in my bag um so first thing this is Sainsbury's receipt for some groceries that we bought the other day. Again, just throw it in. I'm just going to literally pull things out at random. Um, a new t-shirt, a minion t-shirt in size four, oh, five to six. And it was actually in the Tesco sale, so it's three pound. Um, one of my sisters um, bought this for Joshua um, because she saw it. And it's so cute. It says, my daddy is, is it my hero? One in a minion, yeah. And, you know, most little boys love minions and Joshua does love minions, so she bought him that. Um, <clears throat> I've got my little makeup pouch. <coughs> um, it doesn't have a lot in it, actually. I've just got, like, um, it's got a deal, obviously, for Donna. Uh, just got some lip products. I've just got, like, a body spray for freshening up at work. Um, I have like a concealer, a um, lip butter in the shade Raspberry Shortcake, Revlon Lip Butter, uh, Tanya Burr's uh, Lip Gloss in Aurora. I really like that colour, it's really natural. Um, another lipstick which is Rimmel Moisture Renew in um, Amethyst Shimmer, it's like that colour there. I have a, another concealer. I think that's the Rimmel Wake Me Up concealer, but I really like that. And the last thing I have are some lens wipes and my glasses. Oh, and uh, I can't even see in there. Sorry, it's too dark. Um, a couple of like these clips. Don't know what you call them. Um, that's all I've got in there. This bag is from Alphabet Bags, and I really, really like their bags. So I'm just throwing everything back in. So <clears throat> I kind of throw things in there. There's probably things in the bottom of my bag that I do need to put back in there. So we'll see and find out. Um, I have a hairbrush and a spare hairband on the end because 
have long hair you never know when you might need to uh, tie it back and I find that now we're doing the school run when I get to Joshua's school it always just seems to be really windy so I am tying my hair back when I get there at the moment I'm just in the main body of the bag I have Joshua's wallet so it's um George Pig he found a pound in the like back of the sofa this morning so we said he could put it in his wallet and buy some sweeties so I've got the wallet got my purse and it's just like chock of four I've just got a receipt sticking out there um you know just all your cards it's got space for some photos like a wedding photo of Duncan and I and baby Joshua and you know all your store cards receipts that kind of thing um and then you've got like the zipper section here and I have 21p in the trolley token um this is the Kate Spade Stacy wallet Duncan was away on business earlier in the year in Texas and this was an like a really really good price in the Kate Spade outlet so I think he's like texting me at one in the morning I'm like do you want a purse I was like okay so and I absolutely love it it's just so handy and if even if I just want like a debit card and just like pull it out the top so it's really cool um I have my glasses case so it says has anyone seen my glasses um I wear my glasses all the time um originally I only needed them for reading watching tv or computer use oh and driving I was everything but a roamer so you know roaming around and looking um but I now need them all the time and I just like to carry like the lens cloth in the case in case I ever take them off because sometimes I do um and I saw this this was like in the gift shop at Centre Parks and I was like actually I really like that so I keep that in my bag we have a fuel receipt from Tesco I have some Tic Tacs a lolly wrapper I don't even know when that's from normally you know uh, Sainsbury's voucher the ones that printed the till uh, a box of um, paracetamol I have um, oh Joshua's like school photo obviously I'm not going to show you but um, it's just got like a little proof in there because I think the family want to order some copies of the photo have my 2015 um, personal planner and um, I did an unboxing of this um, I never did a follow I never did a follow-up review um, so I can if you want I have recently ordered an Erin Condren planner I've had one before and I've gone for one again um, so you'll probably see an unboxing or a review of that and I also um, have my lovely oh, it's upside down back to front centre parks pen which works writes really nice in there I have my um, iPad mini in a Kath Kitson case it's just the it's telling me to take my vitamin look at that midnight um, yeah really nice case also got that in the gift shop at centre parks it's because we went like the week of my birthday <laughs> I have with the lid fallen off a perfume <clears throat> it's just a Christina Aguilera one just hearing beeping um it's yeah so sorry this is a Christina Aguilera perfume sinful oh red sin and it's really really nice just to like throw on and I wear it for work I have a uh, tissue Pour it. we've all got colds at the moment um I have just trying to rummage in and get it um bought some thank you cards for Joshua um and I've just been like writing these out like as and when I see people to give to say thank you for Joshua's birthday present I'm sure the day will soon come when he can wipe them himself more paracetamols I think I've got like double because my parents never seem to have paracetamols when we come and sometimes you get a headache uh, tissues we're all poorly still got like a croaky voice and a cough um, another petrol receipt just got to unclip these because there's a key fob in this bag my um, house keys for our house because I still have a set for my mum's house but Duncan's popped out to a friend so he's got those I've got like my Peppa Pig keyring, Mummy Pig's keys um, Wild, wild style from Lego Movie. Joshua chose it. 
uh, got a dolphin one that my nose brought back from somewhere Caribbean ish. Pink Lego Land brick for the first time I went there. And <laughs> this sad looking thing did have one of my friends put photos in of the four of us and gave it to all four of us. Um, but I've lost the photos. So that's that. <clears throat> I also have my Oyster card. Um, I don't live in London anymore. Um, but I sometimes go to London. I think Duncan used it recently. For some reason, I can't really remember. Um, and it's still in my bag. And the main thing is now empty. Just some crumbs and stuff. Um, I'm just seeing... Oh, uh, well, as always, it's a true what's in your bag. Feminine products. Because you never know. Or you never know when a friend might need to borrow some from you. So that's in the side pocket. And... The very back zipper pocket, I have like the Michael Kors care card, I think it is, that comes with it. And I also have this little pink purse. It just reminds me of like Kate Spade with the heart. So I think mine has it. Oh no, my other Kate Spade wallet, the lacy, the zip round one, had the heart. Um, it's just like um, from Primark. And it just keeps like overflow store cards that don't fit in my purse. So like... You got your beef eater and um, <clears throat> my hairdresser's card. When I bought this bag, I signed up and got a house Fraser card. You know, it's all those, you know, Nando's card, Starbucks card. Yeah, so all the random cards that I don't reach for like every day, but you might just sit there and think, oh, I need so and so card today. And yeah, so I'll just keep it in a pouch in the back of my bag so that's it that's everything that's in my bag um one thing to mention that usually is in my bag that isn't is my phone but that's because i'm using it to film because my vlogging camera actually went away to be repaired because it, it would make a beepy noise on playback of videos so duncan took it back to john lewis i think where we bought it from two weeks two or three weeks ago and we're just waiting to hear back from them so i am doing videos on my phone so i hope that's okay hope you enjoyed this video uh feel free to click thumbs up subscribe we're a small group but we have some fun you can comment um my contact details um instagram email are in the description box and yeah get in touch and i will see you in my next video bye guys